So last day in Vegas, uh, out here hanging out by the Planet Hollywood Miracle Mile shops, ran in their Mexican place, got some breakfast. You gotta have a Bloody Mary with breakfast in Vegas. But uh, I, I came out and uh, I couldn't help but notice, do you see it? There's a, <laughs> there's a ubiquity antenna right there, in the middle of the strip. <laughs> I got another antenna of some kind over there. I don't know what the hell that is. But that one, literally, you can see the damn Ubiquity logo on it. I don't know, I thought that was kind of funny. Just like yesterday when I was out and I saw all those sector antenna looking things. I wonder what the hell it does, you know? I wonder what they're using it for. Stuff that most people would never notice, but, you know, us, I don't know, wisp people, we see this shit, we go, hmm, I wonder. I do at least. Dude, whoever managed to do that, uh, <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Chuck some shoes on a freaking light pole in the middle of the strip. <laughs> uh, I can't even be mad. <laughs> the uh, good old Bellagio fountains, they're playing the Friends theme, so I don't know. Crank that shit. Ooh. There goes the Blackhawk. Come on, do the, do the big one again, damn it. Come on, do the big one. Aw, oh, freaking bus. Oh yeah, there we go. It's freaking awesome. How they can propel that much water that high? It's crazy. That, that, that takes some effort. <laughs> it takes some force. The water's probably going. 60, 70 feet, a lot of water too. Flamingos at the Flamingo and some ducks. It's crazy the things they had to build to get this up. Like, look at those things. That's some, uh, some serious, serious hardware. <laughs> Kind of freaking cool. A lot bigger than you think when you see it from, you know, a plane or the street or whatever. Doesn't look so big. <laughs> Pretty damn big. And I see sector antennas <laughs> everywhere you go, right? In Vegas, do you go to a Walgreens and see a McLaren? <laughs> Walgreens, McLaren, who'd have ever thought, right? I swear, I've seen this same RS driving around. Ah, oh, it sounds so good. I swear I've seen that thing driving around town all week. So I just walked all the way from Planet Hollywood to Circus Circus, kind of stopping here and there, a little gambling, a little bit of drinking, a little bit of all the Vegas things. Good time, but not a whole lot, really worth videoing. <laughs> I won money playing roulette, which is always a good thing. Especially considering I won yesterday playing roulette as well. So, you know, it's been a, it's been a good roulette trip. <laughs> but yeah, this is uh, Saturday after Wispapalooza and uh, everything's kind of done and over with. Today was kind of just a, a BS day, like hang out and do whatever. I didn't really know what to expect today or what was going on, if anything. Turns out a uh, whole lot of nothing. Mm. But, you know, Circa Circus is cheap as shit, and apparently they're doing, doing it right because the registration line is still just insanely long. Insane. Like the shit goes back all the way through the lobby. It's crazy. So, probably gonna sit here for a few and kinda hang out and do about nothing. Then uh, head over to the airport uh, I do have to say, it's really weird not having to be at the airport until, you know, 30 minutes beforehand. It's very strange, because you're like, you know, me at least, I'm like the whole day, I have to get to the airport, I have to get to the air. With this though, you don't. You, you just kind of show up. It's really weird. <laughs> so I have an extra, literally like hour and a half to kill that I wouldn't have if I, uh, if I was flying out of the, the normal airport. It's pretty damn cool. 
if uh, the whole JSX or something similar operates out of where you're at or where you're going, I highly recommend checking it out because, man, so much time freed up, so much less headache. It's, it's really good. <laughs> it's really good. But yeah, for now, that's it. Um, I'll crank this back up when I get to the airport or the terminal or whatever. Until then, yeah, bye. Back in Phoenix, uh, over here by the, uh, the flip around you bastard, there we go, over here by the private jets and shit. Honestly, like, they're not paying me to say this, the whole jet suite X thing is the best thing ever. It really is. I went from landed on the ground to had my bags where I'm at right now in six minutes. Six minutes. <laughs> it's really something to go from on the ground to hey pick me up in six minutes is unreal unreal and they give you free booze and there's power outlets on the plane i mean it, it really really awesome experience as far as the whole uh, travel thing goes because man travel has gotten kind of miserable over the years i remember growing up it was it was really fun to fly it was a good time to go to the airport now not so much. Jet Suite X though, uh oh man. I know I will not fly anywhere that they fly any other way. It's just so good. It's so good. Super easy, super quick. It's amazing. But yeah, that's the, uh, the Vegas trip all in all. Very, very cool time. Very good uh, to meet everybody and to see everybody and, and it, you know, it, it was a very good trip. So, for now, bye-bye. <laughs>